What's up, you guys? Um, what is up, Bull Fam, Charger Nation? Your boy, George Trask, RWA. Um, <clears throat> so I found some news from the NFL and college football that um, P. Carroll and Nick Saban are retiring from the NFL and college football. Um, um, naturalized that P. Carroll was a former coach for the Seahawks because P. Carroll announces that he's not going back to Seattle because <clears throat> I'm sure he's retiring, but you know. The Chargers need a new coach like Jim Harbaugh, Mike Vrabel, Bill Belichick, or other guys, whatever. I don't care. But I care about the Chargers with Jim Harbaugh to the new era. Because it might be surprisable to be shocked, but believe it. Um, To Brandon Rogers, who's a Seattle Seahawks fan, I feel bad for you, bud. But I think he was getting ready to step down as a coach. And just like Mike Vrabel got fired by Tennessee... Arthur Smith was fired after the post game altercation with uh Dennis Allen because it's because the Saints beat the Falcons. And I know about that, but you know, Nick Saban has won a lot of college football championships, such as Pete Carroll who won a Super Bowl. Um won a college football championship just like as LSU and Seattle Seahawks, as always. So um so immediately at the end, but um not on my watch, but no regrets, so make it happen to any regrets that could be on it, for real. Um, so, the Charger fans, um, immediately with the Raiders and Chief fans, who's going for Seattle in 2013 Super Bowl to beat the Broncos. Russell Wilson beat Peyton Manning. Gina Smith became a Charger before he was a Seahawk with Pete Carroll. Um, Marshawn Lynch, Richard Sherman, um, the Legends of Boom was created by P. Carroll on his team with Seattle. Even the 2013 Seahawks, Stephen Hoshka and, um, John Ryan the punter, you know, the Seahawks won the playoff game, but it's their anniversary of the, the Seahawks win over the Vikings from the wild card in 2015 because Blair Walsh missed a field goal. And yeah, you traded away Russell Wilson because Pete Carroll was immediately announced that he wants to trade Wilson to Denver for anybody with Drew Locke. And yeah, that's why Pete Carroll faced the Eagles at last. It was his final football game as a Seahawk, but you know what? It was all on to uh, Pete Carroll because he had his final two final football games with Seattle against Pittsburgh and Arizona, but um, he did that with Michigan State. That goes to Nick Saban, LSU, and Alabama. I hate Alabama too, but I know Nick Saban's the GOAT, but I hate Alabama. But he lost to Michigan, which it, it was his final college football game against Jim Harbaugh when they lost the Wolverines. To Michigan fans, that goes to unknown Mo Dog. Um, to the rest, um, as still a Chargers fan. I might see that Mike McCarthy could get fired if the Cowboys don't make a deep playoff run to the Super Bowl if he gets fired. But to Cowboy fans, I know Duke bothers, but good luck to your Cowboys on beating Green Bay. It's going to be a good rivalry. But my Chargers are on the offseason, but I'm sorry. We're going to get a new coach. Just like with the Broncos did with hiring Sean Payton coming out of broadcasting to coach again. Um, So Pete Carroll was wish he would have gone back-to-back -back with Seattle. In the Super Bowl, because losing to New England was disgraceful in Arizona in the 2014 season. You know, it was totally that close because uh, Tyler Lockett, um, immediately Marshawn Lynch. He was, like I said, Marshawn Lynch was a great running back. Uh, Richard Sherman, Cam Chancellor. Um, you got the rest. Bobby Wagner, he was good. Bobby Wagner was a great uh, linebacker that played for Seattle. Um, so that's all I got to say. So anyway, you guys, I'm going to head out your boy, Jordan Trask. Peace out and have a good night. But, um, hope you all have a great week and hope you all have a great three-day weekend immediately to Martin Luther King Jr. Day holiday. So anyway, you guys, I'm out. Peace. Have a good night. Hope you all have a good week. So peace. And at last, have a good night.